It's war between Britney Spears and Justin Timberlake. After the alum appeared to take a jab at his ex-girlfriend during his Wednesday, January 31st concert, the blonde beauty hit back at the dad of two. Someone told me someone was talking s about me on the streets. She wrote in the Thursday, February 1st Instagram upload. Do you want to bring it to the court or will you go home crying to your mom like you did last time? I'm not sorry. The toxic singer, 42, added alongside a photo of a basketball hoop. Spears was likely referring to her previous claim, in which she alleged that when she beat JT in basketball years ago, he would cry. The Crossroad actress' latest post was in response to Timberlake's onstage words, in which before he belted out Cry Me a River, a song rumored to be about their romance, the 43-year-old declared, I'd like to take this opportunity to apologize. To absolutely F, nobody. Timberlake made the remark shortly after the mom of two issued a public apology for what she said in her October 2023 memoir. I want to apologize for some of the things I wrote about in my book. If I offended any of the people I genuinely care about I am deeply sorry. She wrote on social media. I also wanted to say I am in love with Justin Timberlake's new song Selfish, it is so good. At the time that Timberlake's track premiered, Spears fans pointed out that the Princess of Pop had a 2011 tune with the same name, which is why out of spite, they made sure the music icon's old track climbed the charts. The former boy band member hasn't directly reacted to the revelations Spears made about their teen romance in her book, many of which he received backlash for. While fans were shocked that the author admitted both herself and Timberlake cheated on each other, many couldn't stop talking about her confession that she had an abortion after getting pregnant with a Rock Your Body singer's baby. It was a surprise, but for me, it wasn't a tragedy. I loved Justin so much. I always expected us to have a family together one day. This would just be much earlier than I'd anticipated, she penned of the situation years ago. But Justin definitely wasn't happy about the pregnancy. He said we weren't ready to have a baby in our lives, that we were way too young. The stars met via the Mickey Mouse Club and dated from 1998 to 2002.